All 19 injured soldiers in the Ladakh bus accident that claimed seven lives of Indian Army personnel have been airlifted to Chandimandir Command Hospital on Friday. Seven Indian Army soldiers lost their lives in a vehicle accident in the Tartuk sector of Ladakh earlier this evening. All 19 soldiers injured in the accident have been airlifted, said Indian Army sources. After the accident, the injured were evacuated to the 403 Field Hospital at Partapur and surgical teams from Leh have moved to Partapur. As many as seven Indian Army soldiers lost their lives after the bus they were travelling in skidded off the road and fell in the Shayok River in the Turtuk sector of Ladakh on Friday. The deceased Malayali soldier has been identified as Lance Havildar Mohammed Sajjal 41, a native of Malapuram. His mortal remains will be brought to his homeland soon. There were 26 soldiers in the bus which was moving from the transit camp in Partapur to a forward location in subsector Hanif. The accident took place at 9 am around 25 km from Thoes. The bus fell to a depth of around 50 to 60 feet, resulting in injuries to all occupants. Prime Minister Narendra Modi condoled the bus accident in Ladakh that claimed seven lives of Indian Army personnel on Friday. Anguished by the bus accident in Ladakh in which we have lost our brave army personnel, my thoughts are with the bereaved families. I hope that the injured recover at the earliest. All possible assistance is being given to the affected PM Modi tweeted. Meanwhile, Union Ministers Amit Shah and Rajnath Singh also expressed their grief on the accident and wish for the speedy recovery of injured army personnel. The accident that took place when an Indian army bus fell into the river in Ladakh is very sad. I express my condolences to the families of our brave soldiers who have lost their lives in this accident. The injured have been taken for speedy treatment. I pray to God for their speedy recovery. Shah tweeted. News desk, Comedy Global.